Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins, The Curse of the Pharaohs. We're on, I think, the final mission? I think the final mission? Well, the final set of missions, because obviously this will... There's usually a couple side missions, as we've seen in these actual afterlife areas. So it's time. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's kill this priestess bitch and get back that... Well, not get back, but get that apple and put it to rest. Clear the way. <clears throat> okay. Let's do this. I should be cautious around here. Am I going this way? It looks like. I feel like I'm going the right way. Yeah, I think I'm going the right way. Okay, I don't know what you guys are doing here. Oh, this is the fort. I'm not even in the right place. Hey, bro, you just need to get... Okay, now... I think it might even just be better to fast travel there. Because I've already unlocked that location. Okay. I know what it is like to lose someone you love. And this orb corrupts everything it touches. It's time to deal with this. I can hear the apple at work. I know what the apple sounds like. And that sounds like the apple. There it is. How is she using it? Now it's the redhead dude, of course. Stop me like common prey now. Bayek. Give me the orb. I do not want to kill you. My mother told me this is our role. To restore Ma'at and put Amun back on his throne. Well, this she was wrong. is why I was born. This is why to hide and watch as they slit your throat. So I would have the strength to do Amun's will. This is not strength. This is savagery. <laughs> it's not going to work out, Bayek. What happened? What happened? What happened? This oh. must end, Isidora. She's you taking us into the afterlife. Our people, your duty. I will not betray mine. Here we go. <clears throat> Let's go, motherfucker. Let's go. Let's go, bitch. Battled you before. I can do it again. Oh, shit. Oh. Oh. Okay. 
fuck off, bitch. I love this ability that I regen my arrows and shit. It's been very useful. Get fucked! Patience, patience, patience. Get on out. So I'm just going to keep regening arrows. The one heal me, ow, and also it gets my adrenaline up without having to go in all the time. So I can do my power attack. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Fucking one-shotted me. Oh no. Because I was alive but I was on, but it set me on fire. <clears throat> So then it just took that last bit of health off me. Fucking hell. Come on. Let's do this. Get fucked, motherfucker! One, two, three, out, 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 out. One, two, out, out. One, two. Oh, no. I fucked that up. It's okay. Come on, he's chasing, he's the aggressor in this one. Ah, oh, fuck. It's hard to get a shot on him. Really just gotta pick and move. If I didn't have that regen arrows ability, this would be fucking shit. But this is the strategy. Regen arrows, get my adrenaline up by shooting him from a distance. Like that. Keeps the health up. And they come in for the power attack. Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, I got greedy as fuck then. I just thought maybe I could pick and move while he was coming in. Get fucked! bit more diversity of attacks than these other undead pharaohs have. Fucking Tutankhamun, you piece of shit. Yeah, fuck you. One, two, three, out, out, out. Really only get one good shot on him when you do that. Yeah, you can only really go for one shot after his attacks. Don't have much time to go for more than that. And even then, you might get caught in that. 
Look at that. I'm starting to time him a little better now. I'm starting to pick his shots. Ah, but even then. Still risky. Still risky. Oh, he's regen quicking. Maybe I should stick to his two shots after a power attack. Shot, then back out, then back out. That's it. Just patience, patience. Oh shit, I was a bit slow to that one. A bit slow to that one too, but it's okay. Oh, good timing. That was good, that one was good. Oh, bouncing out. Good angles, Tyler, good angles. Oh, good distance control, Tyler. I'm very impressed with you right now. Oh, oh, not picking the distance try that time, though. But that's okay. We've got the full adrenaline. Let's get him on the back foot. Two shots now. Not getting too greedy. Yeah, that's it. That's it. We back off after those two shots. Stick and move. Stick and move. him off. Look at that. Just pick him off with little jabs. One, two, back out, back out. This is what we call in the in the sport of fighting, ladies and gentlemen, an aggressive fighter with one dimension against a nice defensive fighter with multiple ways to hit you. He can time you with the counter strikes like that. Or he can pick you off with a little jab, and the jab being those arrow shots. You got nothing for me, Tutankhamen. You got nothing for me, bruh. Oh. Oh, oh, back out, back out. One, two, back out. Don't get greedy. Don't get greedy. He's almost down. He's almost down. He's getting aggressive though. He's getting aggressive. And he's coming in at a different speed and different pace to me now. He's desperate. He knows he's on the back foot. He knows he's losing this fight in the scorecards, ladies and gentlemen. If this goes to a decision, the judges are going to give it to Bayek. I know. <laughs> I watch way too much fighting. Oh, oh shit! Oh shit! He's coming in with really aggressive shots. Way better distance control from Tutankhamen than he was earlier on in this fight. He's picking his shots way better. Bayek running. But he's got the power attack and he does. One, two, stick and move, stick and move. Might only be a couple more shots. He's coming in with different combos now. You're fucked now, Tim coming. It's over. He's dead. It's done. We did it. Nice. Beautiful. Beautiful display of defense and distance. Lift the curse.
Defeat Tomb Kam in the afterlife. Skeleton. Pass down the orb. Tutankhamun wanted to restore balance. He trusted it to the priests of Amun. But Isidora distorted the ritual in the name of vengeance. She betrayed her own gods. Well, Dune Carmen now sleeps eternally. The Ren will guide the way. I guess I gotta follow that thing then. Do I? I guess so. Ooh, what's this afterlife like? Didn't really get to see much. We went straight into battle, didn't we? Straight into combat. Ooh. Mountainous. Interesting. And the blue lotus flower. As we've seen before. Do we keep climbing? Is that what we're going to do? I guess we keep climbing. Where are you taking us? No, bro, you don't want to do this. I'm telling you, you don't want to do this. Whoa, what is this? Looks like a whale's whale carcass. Who's throwing fire at me right now? Who's doing that? I don't like it. Where the hell am I going? Okay. Let's go into another creepy tomb. Or temple, or both. I don't even know anymore. Oh, they're way too high level for me. Oh, it's guiding me out. Oh, yeah, I'm fucking out of here, bro. Oh, you guys are higher level than me. And I'm good. I'm alright just running. If you don't mind. No, get, you can all get fucked. You can all get fucked. <gasps> um, chose you. There's no Amun, you stupid bitch. I do not understand. This was my birthright. <coughs> my revenge. Why did he hear my cry? Why did he give me the power to finish what she started? Only for me to fail. Amun never gave you power. He gave you a choice. <laughs> if Father has my heart. No. My heart is too heavy. Do you believe Amun will protect me? No. As easy as it is to do wrong, it is easy for Amun to be merciful. His wrath passes in a moment. His breath comes back in mercy. 
May the Hidden One walk with you. The Lord of the Duat awaits. What are you going to do with this apple, Bayek? <clears throat> Doesn't belong in human hands. I'll tell you that much. And if you have it, they won't stop hunting you. Oh, we're, s down. we're really helping the redhead dude? Down. I think I could manage on my own. Can you? Uh, I once thought I had no one left in the world. Now I am a descendant of Ramesses the Great. And I have a family bigger than I could have imagined. <coughs> Small price to pay. Thank you, Neff. <gasps> what will you do now with that horror? My raw's light. I do not want it. What the fuck you more reason you should take it. You better than anyone knows what it can do. What the fuck are you doing, Bayek? Bury it. And all memory of it. Alright. But not here. There are no secrets left in this valley. Ah, there must be one more, Sen. You restore Ma'at, then leave? If that is what you want, then no one will hear of you from me. Hey, Bayek. We will meet again in the field of reeds. I will see to it. Righto, okay. I don't trust him still. That is all right. We do not need any help. Close all of this up in a moment. <sighs> yep, okay. I was about to say something's gonna go wrong. No? Quest complete. Curse of the Pharaohs. There it is. Ladies and gentlemen. It's all over now. So. What to do next? Well, ladies and gentlemen, there's plenty of extra content here to do, and as you've probably seen on my channel, even though I finished this pretty early into the release of the DLC, I'm releasing it through the week, and I would have been releasing hopefully a couple of guides as well for the extra stuff that's going on. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is it from me today. Thank you so much for watching this walkthrough of Assassin's Creed Origins Curse of the Pharaohs. I hope you have enjoyed it. I certainly have enjoyed playing it. What a phenomenal, massive expansion. Be repetitive at times, but at the end of the day, it was breathtaking with some amazing moments. Great stuff. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Thanks again, ladies and gentlemen. And I will see you for more Assassin's Creed Origins content and just general videos and return to schedule hopefully as normal next week. Alright guys, thank you. I'll see you later.